everyone, this is Geely, and welcome back to another Let's Play Giant Quest Builders 2! <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and resume my file. Oh, I was like, did I make any other days? I forgot for a bit, it's been a while. <laughs> Alright. Let's get back to it. Go ahead and start. Green Cottage. It looks cute. Alright. So we're working on this day tree again. Let me see what all we need to do. The last episode was, uh, we made the bathroom. Uh-oh. What was that? Something happened. Just now. Shook the place. Geely, the DHG's re restoration is at hand. This is what you must accomplish to bring this about. Spin the seeds of success. Grow lots of crops. You must grow crops of five different varieties. But that is not all. These five-fold crops must cover a total of 250 squares of soil within the farm's boundaries. You may need to search them thoroughly to find the different types of seeds you will require. Alright, so we got three out of the five. I'm guessing, um... She will tell us where the next one is. Someone buried their pumpkin seed in the rainforest so the children of Hargon wouldn't be able to find them. The rainforest is on the other side of Furlfield Bog. Just follow the path until you can find it. Go and have a look and see if you can bring back 30 pumpkin seeds. Alright, so we're going to go and search for 30 pumpkin seeds. Let's see what other quests there is real quick in case something we can do while we're out there. It were blooming scary when the children of Argon attacked one. None of us were Earth, though, and that's what matters. Do you remember what Rosie said about how we could have an harvest festival once we've done all the stuff as we need to do for the day of tree? Well, I can't blame wait for it. I figure I could speed things along by helping you find the seeds you need. According to Pastor Al, there's an old bridge to the east of Furlfield Bog, and they used to grow a different kind of crops somewhere on the other side. Hmm. <laughs> Indeed. It is said there was a vast tomato farm that sprawled over the area to the east of the bog. Until the children of Hargon destroyed it, that is. There may yet be seas buried beneath the soil there. With the aid of your new friend, Reno, you might just be able to find them. Just like sugarcane, there is a particular trick to growing tomatoes, or so I have heard. Alas, I've never seen them grown and can offer you no guidance in this regard. I suggest you search the air same area for someone who can tell you what must be done to help the seas you must find take root. Well, there you go then, Geely. The rest is up to you. Find us 30 tomato seeds and find out how to make them grow, too. Alright. So I got two things we need to search for there. Pumpkins and tomatoes. So, let's see if we're ready for an adventure. I'm gonna have to get here. Sort. Sort. Um, let's see. I kind of want more bridges after last time. It really helped out. Especially when you're bringing your party members along. <laughs> there we go. And... That should probably be good. Do we need any more medicinal? No. I can only make one more. Oh, cabbage. Maybe we can put it in the, uh... The community cabbage here. <laughs> there we go. Although I feel like we can just go ahead and grab this wheat and put it where they can cook it so they can make a bunch of bread instead. Because you can't just eat the wheat, right? dead? Oh, that's because that was the when I thought I was supposed to plant them and then I screwed up there. That's cool. 
Mm -hmm. We'll have them around in case we ever need to plant more later once the other ones die out. So that works out. Let's see. Maybe we'll put away 30. Oh, five more. I know, I'm silly. <laughs> There we go, 150. Alright, so then they can cook them. Tasty. Let's see, what else have they cooked? I'll swap. I'll take your grilled greens, you guys can have the bread. <laughs> that seems fair enough. Alright, I think we're good for our quest. We're going to start... Why do I, I keep pressing the buttons I'm used to on the other one. It's this one. <laughs> Alrighty, so we're going this way. Can I use the shortcut? That's over this side. So then... Oh. Defeat the Bodkin Bowers. To the other side of the bog! Gather tomato seeds! Alright, so I think this is the closest we can get to them. much healing items. I don't even know when you come across some crazies. Friendly farmhand! Alright, so what is the best way to traverse this place? Um, okay, we need to cross the water. I can jump in the water. Make the mistake of staying in the water too long because of the uh, the monster in there. Oh, I found out the hard way before. <laughs> Do I have a bridge from before that I climbed up? Maybe. Hello. I'm going to not get eaten by monsters while climbing here. With a literal dog. <laughs> doggy paddle with the doggy. Alright, there we go. Come team! We must survive. Going where I'm. Oops. You could level up. Oh, there I do. <laughs> Next level. Oh no. I'm asleep. Come on, Malroth. We're almost in the next level. Doggy, are you scared? Let's go. I will need your help. I believe you. <laughs> Thank you. Although I definitely would prefer something besides something that we already have. Way too much of. Tomatoes, my favorite! Snort. 
Oi, you've got some nerve coming into a big bad orc like me with that dopey grin on your face. So, is there something you want from me? Yes, your tomatoes. You're growing a new daydream and you need to learn how to farm some more plants to finish the job. That's a pretty plucky thing for a Don't you know that everyone here follows the children of Hargon? Snort, snort, snort. You got guts, kid, so I'll tell you a thing or two that might come in handy. Once upon a time, this whole area used to be a tomato farm. If you look hard enough, you might even be able to find some seeds still buried around the place. If you do manage to find some tomato seeds, come back here and I'll show you how to grow. I got you. It's already when I'm. Ugh, this stupid orc. This guy is absolutely terrible. I'm trying to help, but if the children of Harkin find I've been cooking for him, I don't know what has me more worn out. All this cooking or all this worrying about what if they'll happen? What'll happen if they find out? Here, I'll help you out. <laughs> He's like, no, you're cooking. <laughs> would not believe in a religion that says you have to starve or else. <laughs> there ain't no religion. You're just buddy. Are we still not rolled up yet? I guess these guys aren't worth much. <laughs> All right, let's go. Hmm. Oh, actually, I guess we don't have to leave, right? It's just we gotta figure out how to find the seeds. Come on, doggy, do your thing. I'm just gonna keep moving around the area. But the dog doesn't want to fight. <laughs> Yay! Love. <laughs> I love how they have the exact same EXP needed to level up to. My HP increased. <laughs> and Map gets stronger. Yay! I can make a new uniform. Oh, interesting. If it's a you want, there are a lot of tomato seeds buried in this box, Squeak. You can't see them with the naked eye, of course, but if you had a full field retriever, it would be able to sniff them out no problem. All right, go, Reno. Oops. Whoa, what the? Is it the water? Oh, there's jellyfish in it. All right, don't touch the water. Apparently dangerous. Right. Lovely. More things to kill me. I love to die. Keep pressing the wrong button. Am I used to different buttons? I think there were just. <laughs> oh my goodness, stop landing in this darn paralysis water. What happened when you land in that poop? With the jellyfish. <laughs> Yes? Can you find Tuto?
Nice. Really? Crap. I do. Oh, too. Oh, but I can't see. I can't. Not for us. Help! <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> Isn't this... Huh. Oh. I must be used to different buttons. <laughs> Alright. I never think it's... Could that be a tomato seed? The one Perry was after? Still need to find out how to plant them though. Let's see if there's someone around here who we can ask. We still need a lot more too. Alright, any more? Come on. Oh, find us more. Yeah. Maybe I'm going to get jellyfish. <laughs> oh, my goodness. <laughs> yeah. I keep getting stuck. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. Ouch. Paralysis! It sucks! Oh my goodness. This is stopping me from fighting. I hate the reverse, it's just so annoying. It's like, seriously, you, you can't just just stay there, you're such a coward. <laughs> Reaper. It's just annoying. It keep disappearing. Aw, oh, sh. I didn't have enough health. Oh, I could probably use that armor I discovered. <laughs> oh, I had to come back here anyways. Oi, Jilly, wake up. Stop playing around. At least you don't have to lose all your stuff, though. Oh, that's a little more convenient. I need some more healing stuff. <laughs> We were almost done with that reaper, too. <laughs> so close. Come on, clap our rock! It's adorable! You get all happy. Cute little... ...destruction. The crop's ready! Yeah! <laughs> Trade. Ooh, fish. Gotta cook. 
<laughs> They're all so happy. Our farm grows bigger and better by the day. Julie will be time for the harvest bus before we know it. I'm just trying to collect your poop. Alright. <laughs> so gross. You're like, yes. Oh, here's my poop. <laughs> Alright, let's check out that cooked fish and then they can cook me fish after this. Yep. I made a fish stick. Mmm, fish. I guess I could also grab all this bread and just put it on the and same thing for the sweets, I could put it over there. So I can easily get to it for dinner. Alright. I got this. Look at all these hearts! They're so hoppy! Yay, happy people. Planting pole. Yeah. That's for the tomatoes. But I think until I'm told, I can't just use it. So, I'll go back. Meanwhile, where is the... See, that one was the wheat, so I'm gonna put wheat seeds here. Nice and even. Just like have half of this. Wheat. And then I want the cabbages all there. Do I have more cabbage seeds? I might not. Oh wait, no, I have a little bit. <laughs> it's enough to finish this row. <laughs> and there. So happy. All right, let's go back and go and get more tomato seeds. Oh yeah, the armor. Almost forgot. Oh yeah, I may as well grab some more greens. And I did say I was gonna feed the other villagers. Let me drop those off while I go into the different rooms. Here we go. You guys can have food. I might switch that for another table because it's tiny. They can have sweeties. So sweets outside and bread inside. Sound reasonable? Oh, I actually no, they have sweets here. That's cool. Oh, that's sweet. Swap it for some bread. So just leave him to it. I'll take that veggie. Alright, sweet. I like the veggies a lot. They heal and they heal with your hunger. It's a win win. <laughs> Alright. Come, team. Wait. Duh. I keep forgetting something. <laughs> I did say I was gonna get that armor. I gave him food. I got more greens. And I need to get armor 
So I'm guessing it's here. Yep. Oh, cool. I can make it. Can I wear it, or is it for now? Rocco? Increases. Alright, where is Malroth? You're so happy. Clap, 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 clap. There you are. Can you wear this? No? Aw, oh, it's just me. Oh well, it is what it is. I guess it's just for me. Mm -hmm. What? <laughs> <laughs> Not a dirt. I need a closer teleport spot right there. There is one. It's kind of annoying. Some skill. She's clearly holding her breath if she can go all the way down here. <laughs> I can't really get to the bottom of the pool very easily. I always float back up, trying to go down. They were trying to teach me how to do it at the up. Uh, well, one of my swim classes, and I was just like, <sighs> floats back up. <laughs> I was like, I don't even know how to do this. <laughs> I only know how to float. <laughs> This is not a bad thing that I float. <laughs> I'm glad they can teleport and they don't get stuck. <laughs> Hopefully with this new armor I can last longer. I hate that I'm not able to give it to anyone. It just seems annoying. Unlike the weapons, it's like uh they could benefit from better armor too. <laughs> Probably go before it's night again. Alright. Oh, they can find more. Perfect. Where are they? Oops. Nice! Thank you. Okay, I need to use these controls. I'm guessing the controls aren't on my I'm natural feeling is probably what it was in the first game. Mm hmm.
It'd be great if you could find me some more. Ooh, wait, is that? Aha! Thank goodness. <laughs> this will make it way easier. This only seems to happen when I'm like streaming. Alright. I'm guessing I need to keep going around. It gets night way too quickly. <laughs> Boy, hurry up! Find the doggone seeds. Go! Find it! Find it, dog! We can't just roam around forever. Stupid reapers come out. They're so annoying. Come on, doggy! Oh, what's this? Interesting. You can use the stinky stuff to change the ground in all sorts of ways. Just try and see, snort. Apparently, I can cook in his little hideout here. The dog's getting cooked. <laughs> night, night. I'll just sleep in this guy's place. <laughs> That's cool. I took his bed. Maybe I should have made him another bed first before taking it. That or Malware off. <laughs> That's cool. Then I don't have to worry about Reapers. Should I plant something for this guy? I got to use your little hideout. <laughs> should give him a free toilet. <laughs> <laughs> Ouch. Give me more fish! Ow. Man, Prowse is so annoying. It just like happens at random times instead of just like all at once. <laughs> Alright, come on. We must find. Is that it? Go! <laughs> Good girl. I think she's a girl. Ah, so annoying. When it comes to these things, like, I just want to put it away. All right, let's see. I'm gonna use this one. You know, I want to collect things. Stop wasting that good earth. Well, we did find thirty, right? Yes, that is exactly 30. Mm -hmm. Alright, let's go back to that dude. He's in the middle. Ew, poopy water.
Oh, poor Malroth. Yeah, it's probably not ready yet. Last I checked. All right, teach us. What's that? You found some tomato seeds already? Snort. I've been waiting a long time for someone like you to come along. A human worthy of learning the ancient secrets of growing tomatoes. All right, grunt. Listen carefully. To grow tomatoes, you need planting poles. You can't just stick the seeds in the ground and expect them to grow. Tomatoes can get pretty heavy, too heavy for the vines to support them. If you don't place planting, planting poles to hold them up, they'll collapse into, under their own weight. It also helps to dig a ditch around your plants. If you fill it with water, the soil will stay wet without needing to be watered. Rain can water your crops for you too, but the soil will still dry out over time. You can't expect the weather to do all your work for you. I've got a field right here, so why don't you try growing some tomatoes in it? You'll need a planting pole for each seed. There should be some still stuck in the ground around here, so go and get them. Train your tomatoes. Go ahead and grow us some tomatoes. All right. All right. Like you've done everything the orc said. Do you reckon I'll sprout now? Either way, let's tell that orc we've done everything he asked. Snort, snort, snort. You're quite the little farmer, aren't you? You've made a perfect little tomato patch. Great going, Jenny. Now we can grow tomatoes of our own. Say, I seem awfully adept at setting up that veggie patch, and there's a very unique hammer you're carrying. You're not a builder, are you? Snort, snort, snort. Don't worry, I'm not one of those children of Hargon loons. I may be a monster, but I'm a feral fuel native. Born and raised. Another builder came to this island long, long ago. It's thanks to his efforts that things were as good as they were. He always looked like he was half asleep, and he was a greedy so-and-so, always raiding the larder he was. But he was always ready to go the extra mile when you needed him. Raiding the larder? You couldn't stay mad at him for it, though. He could grow the finest crops you ever saw. One look at those succulent tomatoes, and all you was forgiven. That's what I'm so Girl, I can't wait for a chance to taste builder-grown food again. I want you to grow as much as you can. These seeds aren't much use to me when my fingers are too fat to plant them. Aww. <laughs> Chubby fingers are <laughs> Oh, there's one more thing I forgot to mention. My friend lives in a cave on the east side of the swamp. She can teach you all about fertilizer, important stuff for training, well, farming. You should go and see her. But if you ever want to know more about Furrowfield, feel free to talk to me again. I'll be more than happy to help snart. Yeah, do I learn point no, planting poles? <laughs> yep. Guessing wood. <laughs> They've been pretty simple on the ingredients here. Alright. We're gonna finish this off, we're gonna have to find some more seeds and make some bigger fields. Back here, do you want me to tell you about this area? tunnel in the way wall of gray rock over there. It leads to the rainforest, where the Bodkin archers live. They're friendly to humans like you, and they know all about trees if you're heading that way. It'd be worth your while to stop and chat. If you pass through the rainforest, there's a little pen peninsula on the other side covered in tombstones. It's like, it's one big graveyard. Please give me the creeps. But, I hear there's a weirdo over there who collects seeds. Sounds like that sort of thing that would interest you. Oh, then there's my friend in a cave to the east of the swamp. She can tell you everything you need to know about fertilizer. Having some fertilizer will make growing tomatoes a lot easier. So if you haven't had a chat with her yet, you should really should. All right, I guess we're gonna go chat. Let's go. After we get us some more crab meat. Yeah, crabs. <laughs> Don't be afraid, little human snort. I'm a friendly orc. I love in it, including humans. And I've heard a rumor about you that you're starting a tomato farm. 
Let me tell you a helpful hint. If you want your vegetables to grow quicker, try using stinky stuff that humans used to put on their fields long ago. Poop poop. Apparently they made it out of night soil and wheat. Perhaps you could try making some yourself. If you do, come and show me one. I've always wondered if it smells as bad as the story said, Snort. Yeah, I can make fertilizer for my own food from do. <laughs> Good stuff. <laughs> So nasty. Oh, it stank. <laughs> What's that smell? Oh, could it be? Human, did you make some of the stinky stuff? Well, don't just stand there. Let's try it out. Put some of it on that tilled soil behind my bed. Oh, okay, so one gets one whole field. That's it, human. You did it. All the tilt soil has been stinkified. Stinkified. Come back here and let's see if we can work out exactly what happened when you did that. It seems that the stinky stuff can turn soil into hummus. Snort grunt. How fascinating. Hummus is fantastic stuff. Any vegetable plant in it will grow much faster than normal soil. Roughly four times faster, in fact. You can use that stinky stuff to grow any plant in a flash. Not just vegetables, trees will shoot right up. Two, use it well and you'll be a natural born nature builder. That said, you're already an excellent builder. You made that stinky stuff all by yourself. All I did was tell you what's in it. I'd shake your hand, but knowing what went into making the stinky stuff, I, I, I know where they've been. <laughs> Instead, I'll give you a present. A little gift to say thanks for letting me see that stinky stuff in action. Yeah. I was planning on planting those in the soil next to my bed, but I'd rather not touch it anymore. And besides, my fingers are far too fat. Even if I manage to grow some tomatoes, I'd never be able to pick them up without crushing them. I've always considered myself something of a naturalist. I love nature and I like to think it loves me, but when it comes to actually growing something, I'm utterly hopeless. Snort. Aww. Fertile ground! I got your heart! Hot. Mm. Do I have one of these on me? I should. Oh, excuse me, I keep burping. Alright. Lovely, lovely. It's raining! Now my hands are cleaned of all the poop, right? <laughs> I mean, if you wanted crab meat all day, I guess you, can, you would have seafood galore in this little spot. <laughs> and fish. Sometimes from the jellyfish. Alright. Enough crab meat. Let's go. I apologize that you are now in oh, pain. Although if we can get some more fish from the jellyfish, I'll take that. <coughs> Excuse me. I said we have plenty of crabs. Why are they not dropping anything? They're so lame. Alright. I'm over them. Let's go. Uh let me be the over map. Alright, so we're gonna head this way. Um, yep. Oh, I should probably see what this is in direction. I need to climb over that? At least this is easily climbable here. Alright, is this where we're going? This was the Bodkin bow Bowers. Boyers. I guess we can finish that first then, and then we'll go and try and get the uh, next seats. Mm. 
Yeah, we had to defeat X amount of them anyways. Did I die here last time? I probably did. <laughs> what you waiting for? Feed him. All right, that's good. Oops. We're almost on level nine, huh? <laughs> The only issue with the snipers is if there's like a bunch of them and then they can get you, but one at a time they're not that bad. Oh, and their art their bows might have paralysis. So that's annoying. So I guess we can go back up now that we got the 10. Oh, beaten up here. Let's go. So do we need to go to the top here? Yep. Up. Go. Up. And up. And up. And up. And let's talk. Hmm. Well fought, human. Bent on destroying the forest. Those bodkin bowers were. But stop them, you did. Know your secret, I do. Builder you are. Yes? Mention the gift I did. Here. Acorns they are. Plant them in healthy soil you could, and grow a tree will. Plant enough in a forest you shall have. And grow a forest you must, builder. Grassy metals too. To the children of Hargon we must not give in. Remember the alliance you must. An ancient pact between the humans, the Bodkin archers, and the fat rats. Much more to say I have, young builder. But for a long time already I have been speaking. If for more knowledge you thirst, if to hear my tale you hunger, then yeah. right, let's find out your tale. Let's learn more background story. The builder I've heard so much about you, that is. So dopey you look. Much dopier than I expected. Why does everyone keep calling me dopey? <laughs> a builder came here long ago, they say. Gallant he was. Bold he was. Wise he was. A most incredible young man. Hmm, <laughs> it matters not. When the days we died, so too did the spoil. Suffer greatly we did. Hunted by the children of Hargon we were. Young builder, if to restore the days you intend, aid you the alliance must. I mean, may. A, com a convenient ages old, the alliances between the bodkins, the fat rats, the wigglies, and the humans. Forgotten by most of this fact is, but the leaders of the tribes keep the memory alive. Keep hope alive. It kind of throws me off when they actually have regular sentences, kind of. One day, over me, this iron will. When the ill wind blows, no more life returns. To the peninsula beyond here, have you been? In the graveyard, away from prime eyes, a collection of seas there is. Escape the place I see. Take. I got it. The trees around here are acorns from the grow, hmm? Plant one in the earth and grow another tree would. But to grow to full size, much time will this acorn require. Should you lack patience, as it might you use, more quickly your acorn will grow. To learn more of this fertilized, do you wish? In a cave by a boy, an orc lives. A naturalist, this creature is. Karat, yes. Yes, I, I met her. We have poop. We have the power of poop! Alright. And there will probably be plenty of nights, so by the time I get back. <laughs> <laughs> this whole this area, I think, relies on the power of poop. <laughs> Granted, I'm, I'm a horrorsman, so I'm probably used to all the poop. <laughs> Fertilizer is key if you want, like, really good crops. <laughs> Ouch. Zombies! I hope my partner is strong at this point. I keep lifting them up. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, yay, you already found some seeds. Hold on, hold on! <laughs> hmm, a human approaches the strangely colored skin you have. Not the healthy green of us Bodkin archers, no. Beyond this bridge, lying in ruins and ancient... There is... Long, long ago, a strange human lived there. They say he was. Very strange indeed, hmm? Roar! That was fast. Yay, a pumpkin seed! What's that? Did you find a new kind of seed? That must be one of those pumpkin seeds that Rosie was talking about. I wonder what it was doing there. Maybe someone dropped it and maybe they're still somewhere nearby. Let's take a look around. We might find some more seeds. Let's go! You gonna find me already? Wow. That's fast, girl. Oh, what am I doing? <coughs> Wrong button. Ah. I'm going to get used to this. <laughs> Eventually. Oh, this is going to be slow if we're doing this one at a time. Come on. Are we really going one at a time? <laughs> I guess for the last one they had to give it, like, more. Difficulty here. Uh, or time consuming. Oh, what's this? Yes. I need to find these more often. Yay! Another warp point. The ruined church. This is great. The dog should find that first for me. The warp points. <laughs> and she's finding them fast, but this whole one at a time thing is still kind of ready. Wait, what's this? Hold on! There's something interesting here. I think. I'm kind of scared now. What is this? Is that a devil? <laughs> Not that it's surprising if there's a devil, considering they're all about the children of Hargon. Oh, I can't read this. Can I like- Yes, I can destroy it. Ha ha ha! I've destroyed your religion! <laughs> Come at me! <laughs> it's creepy. False idol. Of course. That sounds familiar. <laughs> Ew! That's the goddess statue. I'll take that one. That one's cute. <laughs> I guess we just have to keep following her then. There's nothing else interesting to keep in here. We're gonna use the false idol! And then we're gonna throw it at the children of Hargon and be like, I don't care about your darn religion! I like food! <laughs> How dare you stop me from cutting! <laughs> Weird. Where did the dog go? Oh. See any more here? Where are we? Could this be like a person though? Maybe in that door? I'm probably gonna... Oh wait. Never mind, that's the... that tower. And... Is there anyone here? What is this? Oh. Fine, let's go after your pumpkin seed. I'm like... I want
the ghost. Grr, woof, 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 woof. What's up, Reno? Is there something wrong with this gravestone? Hold on. Could this be where the guy who dropped all the seeds is buried? Huh? Gee, look. Over there. Hey, who's there? Show yourself. Oh, no. You found me. Ooh. Is that a pearl field retriever? No wonder you stood me out with such a good sniffer on your side. They're such capricious creatures, though. It isn't just anybody who can tame them and train them like this. <laughs> just who are you? <laughs> you come in search of pumpkin seeds. Is that so? <laughs> when I was alive, I used to grow pumpkins. I would hide the seeds to keep them from the children of Hargon. Not only did they try to steal my seeds, they turned my beautiful church into an unholy shrine of destruction! Oh, woo! If only there was a builder on the island, one who could repair the damage they've done! Oops. What? You're a builder? You don't look like one! In fact, you don't look like much at all! These people are rude. <laughs> if you truly are a builder, perhaps you could restore the church to its original form. If you did, I could give you some seeds in return. Meet me in the church, I will explain what you must do. <laughs> Can I keep the goddess statue? <laughs> Look. <laughs> All right. Mm -hmm. I'm going to get my food first. Yeah. Alright. What are we fixing? Behold, Builder! The children of Hargon have turned my holy altar into this hideous abomination! It just won't do! Hideous? I don't know about that. I think that statue looks kind of cool. You know, the one I took off. Well, I can't stand it! And I want you to smash it to pieces! It's not just a statue, Builder. I want you to build the entire altar into something more suitable! If you really are a builder, then this should be a piece of cake for you! Da -da. Yay! It's time to get building! Holy Altar! Yep, I figure they want to replace with the, uh, the statue. Oh, they already had the book. Oh, this should be an altar and stuff? Candelibrium. Candle. They already have the candles. I'm just saying that I make the altar and move the statue. Ooh, this must be a blueprint! This looks just like the old church altar! The old goddess statue and altar are still hidden in the storeroom <laughs> at the back of the church. Wait. <laughs> you can use them to complete the blueprint <laughs> and restore the altar to its former glory. <laughs> Please repair my church. <laughs> this is some baloney. <laughs> oh, I don't get to keep the goddess statue. Oh well. By the way, the false idol comes from Dragon Quest 2 and it's a important key item in that game if you're interested in knowing. <laughs> the context. Oh, handles on me. Do, 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 do. And oh, and we're placing bots with actual limbs. There. Oh my goodness! I'm not making things better.
What's up with the blue light, though? Sinister scones. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Sorry. Say the goddess statue now. <laughs> They're just fixing it. I want a goddess statue. Actually, it doesn't matter. I'm probably gonna be leaving this place eventually and then going to the next place. Woohoo! My health is as good as new! Thank you! <laughs> Thank you again, Bilfer! It was amazing to watch you at work! This church was constructed long, long ago by a builder who came to Furrowfield, you know. In fact, he made almost everything around here. He turned the whole island from a bare wasteland to a big bountiful utopia. But if a builder did all that, how come everyone around here believes they bring nothing but desolation and despair? Oh, sorry. Wrong person. <laughs> well, that's a long story. <laughs> Hold that thought. We've got company. Children of Hargon. What is the meaning of this abominable altar? What do you bonehead think you're doing destroying an unholy altar to Hargon? And even worse, building something new in its place. Ugh, this is children of Hargon again. Come on, Geely, let's teach Bone Boy here a lesson. Still kind of funny that, uh... <laughs> Malroth, of all people, is what's <laughs> against them. <laughs> Oh! Eat! Eat food! Cook! It's a list! <laughs> you can't stop me from making yum dishes! No, no. Oof. Oh, we got a lot of wood. Mm -hmm. Actually, we always have a lot of wood here. <laughs> Yay! Do I level up yet? Yeah. Boom! Wow. Just barely. Not there yet. So close. Ooh! I was so scared there! I thought I might die again! Thanks for fighting off those fanatics, Builder! Excuse me. And thanks to you too! You may have pointy ears and strange spooky eyes, but you certainly know a thing or two about fighting! What are you anyway? There's such a powerful aura of destruction about you! What are you getting at? I'm just... me. Hmm. Well, if you say so! You've both been such a big, a huge help to me! I owe you my own life! <laughs> what? It's not much, but I want you to have these! Yeah! yeah. Ten? Aw, oh, crud. I still need to find ten more, don't I? There are more where those came from! If you want them, they're hidden underground in the catacombs! You'll have to tear up the floor to get them, but they're all yours! Just promise you'll plant them in good soil and water them every day! If only you can grow a new day tree and hold a harvest festival too! I'd be so happy I think I'd depart this world all together! <laughs> Aww. Oh, what? You're planning to do exactly that? And I can come and join in when you do? I'm so happy I could wait! Is this a trick? Are you trying to make me a stag that I disappear for good? Sorry, I'm just being paranoid! I hope to see you again soon! Good luck with your mission! And don't forget the pumpkin seeds in the basement! <laughs> Alright, so let's go find the last ten. Oh. Is it just a drop? Boom. Yep.
Wow. For my collection. <laughs> Yay! Pumpkin! Okay, let me go talk to the rat. Squeak! What's a human doing in the basement of run-down, beaten-up old church like this? You're definitely more man than mouse. Masking your way, making your way down here. The church is haunted, you know. Squeak! They say the priest here used to collect seeds to grow in his beautiful garden, but now he haunts the church he once called home. These church has contained his most prized possessions, the seeds he spent his entire life collecting. Not another living soul knows they're here. You could help yourself and nobody would ever be any wi the wiser. But don't blame me if the ghost of that priest comes to take his prized possessions back. Squeak, squeak, squeak. Don't worry, he gave them to me. He's my friend! <laughs> On that note, is there anything else here? Interesting. Maybe not. Mm -hmm. Nope, just a way up. And out. And I'm- wow. I'm on the edge. get rid of it. poop water huh? and just like exchange it for real water <coughs> I got poop water everywhere can't scoop this up just yet. I don't get why. Is it because there's still too much poop water? Am I stuck with poop? Can I get rid of the poop water? <laughs> I'm just gonna flood this place till I get rid of it. Too late, now they're all flooded. <laughs> and poop water. I guess this explains the zombies though. Whoa, did I just get his heart? Level up! Mouth gets stronger and I. Beat! <laughs> yeah! And. I learned a new recipe. I can make a pot lid. Aw, oh, yay! That's so much good defense. <laughs> Plus five. <laughs> Let's see. Anything else worth grabbing around before I go? Just zombies. Zombies! <laughs> oh, I got their poop. Ew. Oh, and of course the Reaper's back. So, yeah, we can go. I'm going back home. Let's grow some crops.